Hey, hey, what's up, you guys? My name's Clayton. You're watching my channel, Runs in Our Blood. I just got done with two days of fishing. First day, I went out originally for some shad, but I didn't have any luck catching any shad. Luckily, <clears throat> on the way there, I stopped at the bait shop and picked up some live worms and uh, ended up catching quite a few catfish. I caught a lot of small ones, a couple of keepers. And then the day after that, I just went back out in the, into the lake and uh, did a little bit of uh, crappie fishing, speck fishing. Did pretty good. So I'm gonna go out here, I'm gonna clean these things and I'm gonna run this footage for you. I've been out here working on a little project, getting the boat ready for tonight. I'll give you a little sneak peek. So y'all stay tuned, it should be interesting. But I'm going to run some of this footage from the first day, and then I'll meet you guys back in the kitchen. We got something. Caught him on the worm on the old uh oh little catfish. Little bitty catfish. <laughs> Look at this out here with a damn surf fishing pole. <laughs> oh this one right here will get you. you ain't careful. Easy buddy. Don't poke me. I'm looking for something just a little bit bigger than that. <laughs> I just left this on. I was going to retie a damn just a smaller setup on the end of this, but hell. That seemed to work. <laughs> Dang. Hopefully this one's a little bit bigger. I think I'm looking for something to eat. Feels bigger. Uh, 
I'm like, yeah, easy now. Damn, something stole my other worm. <laughs> Can't believe I'm catching them on this big old dang salt rig. Ah, my damn pliers. Still want them a little bit bigger. I'm going to rig up a smaller setup. That's what I was over there doing. Trying to rig up something a little bit smaller than this. <laughs> I don't know. There's got to be bigger ones down there. I might as well throw one more worm on this one. Just using some live worms that I picked up. All right. Let's get that one back out. Maybe I can finish rigging up that other one. I'm going to rig that other one up just a single hook with a little lid on it. This is a little overkill. You got something. Don't feel like a catfish there. <laughs> Good God. Ain't that a dang sight right there. Pretty though. I'm sure pretty. All right. What in the world? The world's smallest catfish. <laughs> yeah, grief. I think my damn saltwater rig was working better. He don't feel very big, but he almost damn jerked the pole out of the boat. Whoa. Oh, where are you going under there? Well, he went up underneath the dam, down there in that hole. I'm gonna get him out. Works something a little bit better. Huh. Another little bitty catfish. Oh, damn, and he like swallowed the friggin' hook. Yeah, Lord. That looks like about all the size that's here. I'm about to move. All right, well, I moved again. Got something. Something pretty decent. Oh, yeah. Oh, bigger catfish. Finally. <laughs> Check him out. Damn me pretty. Heck yeah, that is a keeper. Well, by God, I'm keeping it. <laughs> My pliers good. Oh, down here on the floor. Good eating right there. <laughs> right. I was just reeling in the poles. I'm not damn. I said hell with it. I'm going to the house. My daughter's about to get off the bus, and we got something decent on here. Yeah, head to the house. I want to see my girl. She's getting off the bus soon. And I just, so there was something hitting it earlier. And uh, I went to reel it in and there he is. <laughs> Damn good catfish. Well, hell. At least we got two for today. I'm going to come back in the morning. I'll probably make this video today and tomorrow. And uh, see what I can do tomorrow. I might go spec fishing in the morning. We just had a cold front come through. It is a full moon, but hell, we'll see what happens. Where are my pliers? All right, so we ended up with two catfish. Not too bad. I just got them all cleaned up. Catfish in there. Got the crappie in there, AKA specs. Heating up the peanut oil. We're doing just some, uh, I don't even know what they, what are they called? Field peas? Yeah. Field peas, they taste like black eyed peas. But I did my batter with uh, some Zatarans, Southern fish fry. We're gonna make some tacos. I had Cajun seasoning, but I did add what I had left in there with it. My wife's making up some tartar sauce. And a guy in the comments actually said that they do a splash of Worcestershire. Worcestershire, Worcestershire Schminer, I don't know. But uh, he said they do a splash of that with their tartar sauce. But otherwise, it's this exact same recipe. So we just 
added a little bit of that in there. I'm gonna test it out, see how it turns out. I'm sure it'll be good. But uh, we're gonna do tacos. I don't know if I said that already, but uh, I'm gonna walk out to the garden. I haven't done a garden update in a while. So I'm gonna walk out there, show you guys the garden, grab a little bit of lettuce for these tacos. And uh, while I'm doing that, I'm gonna play the second day footage of catching these uh, specks. See you on a minute. All right, walk out here to the garden. Grab some lettuce. Oh, <laughs> it ain't been, I don't know, five minutes and the buzzards already found my, my fish. They don't waste no time. The garden's been doing pretty good. Uh, it's It hasn't been that cold this year. We finally getting a little bit of cold, but my sugar snaps it did absolutely nothing. I threw a couple of lettuce in there with it. And then some of the lettuce, it's, it's bolting from it being too hot. But the butter crunch and the romaine's doing, doing good. Broccoli, some of it's doing better than others. Little bit of broccoli down there and the cabbages my favorite they are well on their way That's the best one so far. Heck yeah. Dang it, it was barely on him. Right. Oh. Whoa. But yeah, right, right there. Right there where you, you know, we were casting last year. All right. See? Dang, he's all hung up back here. I don't want him to come off. Here, my damn trim pad. Oh, there's another one over there. Come on. Good. Shoot, that one ain't bad. 
This one feels like a real good one. And it was a full moon last night. Oh yeah, he's good. Damn good one. This is on one of them Jim Porter. I'll put the links below, but it's on a Jim Porter. I think, they, I think he calls it the perfect jig. That was the white body with pink. Got that one. And we got this one. what I'm talking about and that was on a white so an old white jig that I had all of them's had the fireballs on there I'll put the link to the fireballs down below as well I'm gonna throw some fireballs on and get them put back out Uh, dang, as soon as my dad showed up, I quit catching fish and now he's catching all the damn fish. What's up with that? Ever since he showed up, I ain't been catching nothing. He said, you got to rock your boat. <coughs> so we're going to rock it real quick. Damn, he's been catching them though. Damn, he's jigging. Right. Just got done frying the fish. Made me a taco up with some tartar sauce, some cheese, and a little bit of that lettuce on there. I'm about to try this tartar sauce. A little crunchy piece to try. This damn Worcestershire sauce on here. Don't taste much different. <laughs> Maybe we didn't. It's good though. <laughs> Might not have put enough in there. I mean, it it sort of tastes a little bit different. Hell, I'd put it in there next time too, so. <laughs> I don't know. Either way, let's try this thing. Get these little bitty tacos. That's hard to beat right there. <laughs> Lettuce from our garden. Fish from the lake. Cheese from Publix. <laughs> Only in tartar sauce. Don't get no better than that. All right. Well, my wife did it a little bit differently than I did. <laughs> she took one of them big old, big old leafy greens. <laughs> I made a roll up out of it. Ain't bad, is it good? No, it's good. We're gonna finish off the rest of this fish. Well, I gotta save a few pieces for my daughter because she, <laughs> she'd be mad if she knew that we ate some fried fish without her. And then I gotta go jump in the bed. I gotta actually take a nap for uh, the adventure that we have planned for tonight. But uh, y'all stay tuned. It should hopefully be a really good video so uh you guys like subscribe and i hope you have a great day we'll see you next time <laughs>